I don't know. Uh, you, you, you step on the ride, I think. You just, uh, it kind of builds on its own. Um, this is a tricky book for me because uh, we, don't, we don't go on and stay on. We go on and then we go off and then there are three songs and then we go back on but we're kind of still at that level. So your backstage uh, or your offstage life has to kind of keep alive. So you have to kind of keep the, the, the pot stirring uh, as what happened just, you know, what, what was the last scene with Ben? What was the last scene with Sally? You know, what did Buddy and I just do? So, there, you know, you have a different relationship with everybody. So I think we all kind of feel that we have to kind of keep, keep in the game. And, uh, you know, every time I approach Ben, there's some kind of a, a put down or... And I think she's just through talking to Buddy and talking to Sally and seeing Sally uh, have this, to me, ridiculous dream and uh, agenda for this party and, and how he, he's going... I just know he's going to probably lead her on. And, and it's just... It, it, it's... Um, and when he says the things he says to her in the, in the final scene before, could I leave you, he says, you know, pack a bag and disappear. You know, the only thing I want from you is a divorce. And I think it's just this, you know, it's like, to me, it's, it would be kind of like physical abuse. If somebody just, just went at you and at you and at you and then just finally went whap across the face. And I think it just is a clarity. All of a sudden, her everything, everything she's done, her life, what she's given up is just, it just starts to come in uh, as clear as a bell. And that's, how she, and that's how she gets to these incredibly intelligent lyrics and these, you know, these, it's, it's just poetic what she says almost. And I think that that's what you have to, uh, that's what I do at least. <laughs>